there is a time of crying for yourself. When you want to cry for yourself, it is good when you start to see what darkness is doing in your life. These are your failures. These are the sicknesses which you have in your body. But there is a time of crying for yourself. It's when you are crying, now calling the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Can we read the word of God together? So we are in this year which Jesus Christ declared that this is the year of the new beginning. Because he has seen you that really you were very discouraged. You met many things which were not good. But Christ Jesus, because he loves you, he says, Behold. Behold. At this year, this is your time of the new beginnings. Because he is working great things in the spiritual world. Disarming those who are claiming to have powers. And putting them down. They remained not having any power. Once you are removed by Jesus Christ from the power which you were used, know that there is no replacement. Jesus Christ is working all this. Yeso Christo oko shuma hezi. For the glory of his name. Ruchitero bugara hazina lawe. He wants his name to receive the glory and the honor. Oko to da zina lawe lichi wana bugara na kuri iso. Because this is the only one name. Ngaurindilone zina liti lilote. Which we were given. Lera newa lone. For us to be saved and for us to be delivered. The name of Jesus Christ. So this name has power and authority everywhere. In every corner in the whole world. This name has authority. Also under the earth. This name has authority. This is the name of Jesus Christ. So we are here because of this name. But the time when Jesus Christ will be saving you and is setting you free. Know that only his name will be glorified. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Only the name of Jesus Christ will be glorified. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Really, this is the name. 
Leli ndilo nezina. Can we read together from the book of the Gospel of Luke chapter 23? Karibale rote uvaka ewangeli ya mafungo madhipa aluka. Ndimandi ya mahumi mawili nantaru. Chapter 23 we shall read from verse 44. Hunera dobara hone ndika nandima na tuku ya mahumi mananana. To verse 46. Then we end up by reading verse 47. It says, It was now about noon, and darkness came over the whole land until three in the afternoon. For the sun stopped shining, and the curtain of the temple was torn in two, Jesus called out with a loud voice, Father, into your hands I commit my spirit. When he had said this, he breathed his last. Huno huchesika chikati chabutanu nabutihi hadha sui sui shangu nilote. La gumanga chikati cha butanu na buna. Duba la shifara huno ngwenda uotsiraho chiketwa ketwa wakerua ngabukati. Huno yeso avizelira ngaifili huru ari. Koti anga muya wanga ndi ukumeza zandani zao ari uraro aferewa. Praise the Lord. Amen. The scripture which we have read is telling us about the time of the crucifixion of Jesus Christ. That was the death of Jesus Christ. By the time of his death, we hear that it was in the noonday. Rifazauri hoba hochipinga changa masuyari. In the noonday, we understand it very well according to the time which we know. Nga masuyari riazitaru kanya zabode uyanga zupinga zunera zudiba. When it was in the noonday, Mose choba chichikati cha masuyari. When those who crucified him, they were thinking that, ah, is over with him. The Bible recorded something. It says when it was about the noonday, darkness came over the whole land. I want you to look at this as if now we are in the time of the death of Jesus Christ. When our watches are still telling us the truth, when our watches are telling us the time, the true time, look now when it was in the noonday, quickly darkness came over the land. What are you learning? And again, I want you to look at this situation and try to think about what other people were saying. In other words, your face says it. If this is scary, it's frightening. Because this is unexpected. Generations and generations they came and passed. 
Mirapo na mirapo yada ya fuka. But they never witnessed. Pezi hezi abongo zivona. What the people who were there by the time of Jesus Christ witnessed. Zeva tu. Wewa abe hone nga chipinga cha yeso ba zivona. Zito risumbe za uri hoi yeso. It shows us that this Jesus. Huna zime zitu nga ngomu kaye. There is something within him. The, the word of God declared that he was the son of God, a true legitimate son of God. Who came just to save or to redeem the world. To deliver people from the bondages of sin. Look at this demonstration. Which God the Father did. God allowed the Son to stop. God the Father allowed also the darkness to cover the land. But as the confirmation of His Son, Jesus, that he came to redeem those who are called human beings. Then at the same time, the Bible says the sun stopped. The sun stopped to shine. I want you to look at three things which happened at the time of the death of Jesus Christ. Darkness covered the whole land. Number two, the sun stopped shining. Number three, the curtain of the temple was torn into two. Three things which happened but the time of the death of Jesus Christ. All these three things are confirming that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. When you are receiving this confirmation, these confirmations are taking you now. To the Lord Jesus Christ who came for you. Now you have to look at him. As the son of God who came for you. You have to know him. As the deliverer who came for you. Again, you have to know him as the Savior who came for you. You can mention all the good things. The healer who came to heal you. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Three things which happened by the time of the death of Jesus Christ. Darkness came over the land. The sun stopped shining. The curtain in the temple was torn into two. And we hear that after that Jesus said, when he was breathing into the last, Father, into your hands I commit my soul. All what Jesus Christ did on the cross, he was doing for you. For you to do what? For you to do what is written now in the same chapter. If we read from verse 
From the same chapter 23, the Gospel of Luke, verse 27 to verse 29, a large number of people followed him, including women who mourned and wailed for him. Jesus turned and said that to them, Daughters of Jerusalem, do not weep for me. Weep for yourself and for your children. For the time will come when you will say, Blessed are the childless women, the wombs that never bore, and the breasts that never nest. Hatevera gogofuru lavatu, Navasazi ve vava votungupara, vachimurire. Yeso abaremburu chera amba nabo ari. Inuiba nanya naba Yerusalem. Nisongurire la ne. Dirirere ni nirirere naba nabano. Ngauri hudo da maduba. Ane vaduri mashudu. Vasina vana mashudu. Miviri isongo beba. Na madamu asongo mamisa. Hmm. Jesus Christ says, yes, so Christ, Uri. cry for yourself. So under this topic which says, there is a time of crying for yourself. When you want to cry for yourself, it is good when you start to see what darkness is doing in your life. These are your failures. These are the sicknesses which you have in your body. These are the problems in your village or in your community. These are the problems which you have in your country. These are the problems which you have in your work. But there is a time of crying for yourself. It's when you are crying now calling the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ who demonstrated his power and authority. Jesus Christ who demonstrated his power and authority. But the time of his death, when he was dying there for you, look what happened. Also natural things responded to his death. The sun responded to his death. Also darkness responded to his death. Hey, this is Jesus Christ. Who is Jesus Christ? Who is having authority and power? If all the natural things, also the nature, responded to his death, all your problems, they have to surrender to Jesus Christ. There must be changes in your problems. Also the sicknesses in your body. When they hear the name Jesus Christ, they have to respond. Also hidden things in your body. When they hear the name of Jesus Christ. They must respond to this name. Also stolen things in your community. They must be respond. Where they are they must respond. Also stolen blessings in your area. Must respond. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Also on the other side. Stubborn demons. They must listen. Again. Those who are claiming that the big bosses of the witches. When we are here. 
they must get shaken by the power of Jesus. All the tools which have swallowed your things, they must quickly vomit them. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. Hey, somebody in your home who is very stubborn who doesn't want to hear anything about church anything about pastor anything about Jesus I say when we are here the power of Jesus will reach him will reach her Hallelujah Amen. Some of them you will hear them tomorrow saying do not leave me behind. I'm going to the church with you. I heard that there is a church in Arabali Stadium. Know that hey, because of the death of Jesus Christ. Oh, because of this death. All things which are not good, which are opposing Jesus, they must surrender themselves. Praise the Lord. And also the shade, because many people, you mustn't blame them. Many people who don't want to hear anything about Jesus, anything about church, they, they are living in the shade. What's he They are in obscurity. Their eyes are blinded. They the, according to the language that Christ is teaching us, he says when the soul of a person is stolen, hey. something has happened. He says you can do whatever. Whenever I number two. No. When the soul is stolen, you won't find it lingering in the space. It is kept somewhere, locked up tightly. Yes, sir. Jesus says, when the soul is stolen, put inside a cage is like in the kingdom of darkness they use anything it's not just like the strong room that you are familiar with the soul it is the soul that is stolen you are put in a cage locked up and something evil is said pertaining to you. And the spirits are put on guard. And an exchange is made. The soul part When the soul part is stolen. And in that same space. A, a certain spirit is put inside. And certain tools are invested. When that person gets drunk, you can do whatever. You are not if that person's soul is stolen and that person is given the assignment or the mission to drink beer or alcohol until retirement on this earth when the situation is like that, when the situation is like that, 
and ela mamu yato funa zone re arko tonda zwez romu ano mutu. Tiwa ni madoko kwa tamkuma. When the situation. Babu zana zana zuto kubare Henry kote sebe uba dinanga mande didin sawo chamba na. Baku ita Henry ba unoba coach ya zinu zone zamudir ba coach ya rapam dinu one. Mamu yani umati oito mu na wabo puli. Omu pango se food, omu kinero. Ndiyo no no reason you have kuchara ya mudi ya zindrap. Wana ba ima ba chere. Eh, ni songo chamba na. Songo chamba na wana uti. Ndiyo ba iti sa shumye ba. Chamba wa soko mbala zi bia feizi. Wana Yesu suko toda Yesu. Aba rinditu wa uza zi toda Yesu. When the situation is like that, when the soul has been put in a cage, and your husband is given the mission of drinking or abusing alcohol, you can say whatever. That person will never leave alcohol. You can even mobilize the children to, to be against your father. It will not work. They use things that you cannot even suspect. But when is your time to cry for yourself? The bondages will leave you. Chains will get loose. And again, the spirits in you they will get burned by the fire and leave you. They will leave you and leave your house and leave your children. And leave your businesses when you are crying for yourself. There is a time of crying for yourself. We cry only in the name of Jesus. When we are crying and calling the name of Jesus, Jesus Christ is able to change the situation. If his death changed the situation, if the ordinary nature responded, every situation in your life will respond to the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. It won't be you responding. It will be the name of Jesus responding. Amen. In the afternoon when the sun is right on top of your head. When darkness is enjoying having you. Are you aware that there are times when spirits are celebrating? They only enjoy when you are being tormented. When things are not working out in your family. Just clap your hands for that proverb. It is said that when the sun rises up for you, you have to position yourself to enjoy it all. Aha. Amen. 
When you are trying to lot of it about CC, Wonga, Zino Kavak, where Rufura Yesu Rita me. Uriba Sisu on a bacadiri, Roli Tavela Ricoliora, Lidumbuti. Listen, when darkness is celebrating, enjoying, tormenting you, right when the party is on, Aha. they will be in a big surprise because Jesus is going to turn the situation around. When the party is still on, he's about to make a departure back to Yagida. But yo, yo, Tiri, the party is the one I'm about to make with. Who feels it don't want it or yo? Things will just come to a standstill. Touch yourself and say, in my life, the party of the kingdom of darkness comes to an end today. That will be the demonstration in your life. That Jesus Christ died for you. That Jesus Christ came specially for you. Amen. Amen. Bakuri kardo tu imagine zabudi, but waka diri ni masere la apu zinapa apa razilo ni au nana mawone a namtu ofunga mawone rdivi zuru nga gai na zipola kari zidivi zuru ani ya reone matuko to latori boapa wite. Can you imagine what can happen if the the the, the light just disappears? We don't know where the plugs are any anywhere where we can switch anything on. What can happen? Apu na duba liko mudi madari chu. Can you imagine even the sun disappearing or standing still? And everything comes to a standstill. Many of you can knock against this steel. Many of you can cry and say, would somebody please put on the lights of the car just at least so that we can see one another. In other words, Jesus Christ demonstrated already that he is the son of God. Praise the Lord. Amen. He is the son of God, God who created nature. That is why also the nature responded to his death. Praise the Lord. Amen. So Jesus Christ is against all the evil which are in your life today. Yeso Christo uruana mibu soyote ya sisi ine ya wakavu ne uchuro ni namusi. Wubi hoto no kuite ya kavu churo hawe yeso kuruana zazi todi ya zuzi tu. All the evil that is operating in your life, Jesus is against all those things. Dinga zozo te. That is the reason why all those things, all those things should respond today. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. But there is a time of crying for yourself. You must cry for yourself the two things, spiritual things and the physical things. The spiritual things for yourself the spiritual things for your family the spiritual things for your village for your town, for your city and the spiritual things for the whole world and again you must pray and you must cry for yourself, for the physical things. You are still living here on earth. You need the things of this world. We, we can't just ignore all these other things and console ourselves by saying as long as we are born here on earth, we need also the things of this world for us to live well. Amen. Amen. For us to come here, we came with cars, some with taxis, some with the buses, some with the... They've walked. Doesn't those things mean money? 
Money is necessary in this world. Coming to you, not passing to through you to others. Command Commanded to go straight to you. Who is saving the, the authority to command? It's only Jesus. It's only Jesus. I've heard another man. When Jesus Christ now commanded money to follow him, this man started by saying, Hey, I need more prayers. Because my mind is still behind. My mind is still little. Now Jesus is bringing the millions. I need more grace to calculate these millions. But who directed those millions? It's Jesus Christ. You and I, we have our physical needs of this world. But we will receive them when we cry for ourselves and we cry for our children. We are in the beginning of the year. Our children, those who pass the metric, now they need more grace for them to continue with the studies. But when you are here, you are here to receive that grace for your child. Some of you, your children, they want marriages. So you are here to receive the marriage of your children. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. There are many things which you can call when you are crying in the service of Jesus Christ. Crying is when you are calling the name of Jesus. Asking. Knocking. Seeking. Then the Lord Jesus is able to give you. And you who are not yet born again, you must cry for your soul. You must cry for your spirit. You must cry that really your soul must be saved. You need salvation which comes from Jesus Christ. You need Jesus. You must be born again for you to see the kingdom of God. It doesn't end in just asking. There are superior things above what we can ask. It's when we receive salvation. Your inner man must be saved. You must be connected with Jesus Christ because you are coming from Him. You must be connected with Jesus because don't allow your spirit to leave your body having not accepted Jesus. You accept the Lord Jesus Christ when you are still in your body. Don't care about any other thing that can hinder you from getting closer to Jesus. You come just as you are with your loads and burdens. Jesus is able to relieve you of your burdens. Because these burdens will prevent you or hinder you from entering into the kingdom of God. It's those loads of things that are hindering you. 
Everything that you are unable to fix yourself, you bring it to Jesus. Jesus is able to relieve you of your burdens. And then you are able to access the kingdom of God. Because the kingdom of God has come with Jesus Christ. And he teaches us about this kingdom. Can we read the Gospel of Matthew chapter 11? Verse 28 to 30, it says, Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Ngauri. Jogo yanga ai gogoni muwaro wanga warerua. Praise the Lord. Amen. This is the altar call from our Lord Jesus Christ. Nimbizo ya uda aleta reni ya morena wa Yesu Kristo. I say today. Ndere kabone na musi. When you come out from this stadium. Musi wone bachi tuwa hapa kaichi stadium. You will be saying. Wone badu ambabari. Surely. Zabukuma kuuma. Jesus Christ is the. Son of God. You will declare it having been confirmed in your inner man. You are going to feel this name doing something great in your life. The very same day of the day. This name of Jesus will perform miracles in your life from today. You are going to see this name of Jesus Christ fighting for you in your life. You are going to see this name of Jesus protecting you in your home and in your life. You will end up by saying, surely Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Like what verse 47 tells us from the same scripture which we have read it says so when the centurion saw what had happened he glorified God saying certainly this was a righteous man the other version says surely this was a righteous man Verse 47 yari, Nduna ya wazia mbi, achibona zichiraro, arenda muzimu, ari, nangoho, mutu uyu, oba uruga. Nangoho mutu uyu, oba uruga. Kapo nea shunga pilili ya pupisi. With you, it but won't end up just Nango, there. Nangoho, Yesu Christo, ndi murua wa mzi. You will say, indeed, Jesus Christ but is the Son of God. Nangoho, Yesu Christo, odela ne. And you will continue and yes, declare, indeed, Jesus came for me. But you have to see Nango, that. Nangoho, Yesu Christo, odela ne chipambano. Indeed, Jesus Christ died on my behalf on that cross. Praise the Lord. Amen. There is a time of cry for yourself. Cry for yourself in the spiritual things and in the physical things. But all things which were not good, which were tormenting your life, when you are crying, for yourself, 
Calling the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ. Yes, so is able to stop them. Stop your hands. What is it that is taking you, tossing you to and fro? What kind of a merry go round is taking place in your household? The chaos that is taking place in your family. They do not surpass the name of Jesus. The, the gossips taking place in your household. Gossiping about you. As you fear it, Jesus Christ. They do not surpass the name of Jesus. All the big shots in the world of witchcraft. They do not surpass the name of Jesus. All the Sangomas who send things directed at you, they are not greater than Jesus. All the spirits that are planning against you. Declaring all kinds, all kinds of concussions, speaking bad, so that you can find or be involved in an accident of some kind, they are not greater than Jesus. You will see Jesus Christ on the road. You will see Jesus Christ in your home. What kind of sicknesses were labeled against you? And you were told that it is too late. Those sicknesses are not above Jesus. What is it that you were told? That you have to forget things will never change. Were you told that your womb was done something else. Those words are not greater than the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Some people, were you told by other people saying, if you, are, you enter into the kingdom of God, it will also be well with us. These are people whose intention is to discourage you, making you to feel like your Christianity is useless. Jesus has died for you on the cross. Yes, Christ, All who are not yet born again when we are responding to the word. It's your time to be saved. It's your time to be born again. Where are you? Where are you? I say this is your time. Your best, best time. For you to be born again. I say, stand up from where you are. Come to the altar. Come and receive Jesus. The one who died for you on the cross. Come and receive Jesus Christ. It's your time to be born again. The chains of sins must be broken in your life. Bondages of sin must be broken in your life. Sin blocks blessings. Sin can delay you. It can delay you with an intention of destroying you or killing you. Stand up and say today is the day during which I receive today I start a new chapter of my life. I have started a new 
year and my life should be new as well. He said, as long I've been hearing about this Jesus, but today, I get saved. Today, I take Jesus. Today, I become a new person. Today, I become the redeemed of the Lord today. I get washed in the blood of Jesus. You have used or applied the blood of goats and other things. It's enough. Nothing happened and yet you were paid for all this. You know, we're not even partaking of the flesh. I call upon and say, here is the blood. The blood that was shed on the cross. He died for you on that cross. He suffered for you on that cross. Today, you have to put on new power. Some of you live under the bondage of fear. You fear witches, you fear demons, you fear devil worshippers. You fear Satanism. Come to Jesus, you will never be afraid of them. Anymore. You will understand that they were defeated by Jesus on the cross. Come and receive Jesus. Come and receive Jesus. Aren't you surprised in the way your things are shaping up? If you, you expect to see uh, uh, tormenting things, you will always be experiencing tormenting things. In other words, there are people who say negative things and send spells upon you. This is not a joke, this is a reality. When they, they take off their clothes and turn their behind towards you. What happens when somebody is, it, you know what happens, what comes out, and what makes a very funny sound. Because in the kingdom of God, they don't use silent things. They have to make sure that there is a notable sound that comes out for it to work. Do you understand what I'm saying? People, are you with me? I say they turn their they backs now. and bend, releasing that air from behind. And say we are sending spells towards your home. Let there be fights and conflicts in the house, always. And, 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 and seal everything with a big sound that comes from behind. You will go anywhere. You won't win. You only win when you come to Jesus. In other words, when I say some of you are living in Tachira, I'm saying you are living in a curse. Kasamba. Hey. You have been cursed. Not by somebody you see. It is true that some, some people will come and do it face to face. Some people will come and do it so salvation helps you to know God, to read the Bible, to pray for yourself, and stand on your own. You no longer are afraid of being cold during the night. You only know that only Jesus is the one who will call you. Praise the Lord. 
I say victory has come to your household. Jesus brought victory to you. The death of Jesus Christ is victory to us. Praise the Lord. Amen. His resurrection means victory to us. Lift up your hands. And follow me in this prayer. Say Lord Jesus Christ. Today, I'm receiving you as my Lord and my Savior. Come into my heart and give me new life. I believe that you are the Son of God. And you died for me on the cross. So today, I'm receiving you as my Lord and my Savior. Change my life today and write my name in the book of life. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Amen. Amen. Put down your hands. Glory to Jesus. The ushers, please come to the front. Other spirits are arrested now. You're salvation. It's afraid of salvation. Yes, Jesus it has entered It means that there were certain spirits who were, who were demanding to stay in her, taking ownership of her. Controlling the person. Today, you are arrested. You live there and go, go away from here in the name of Jesus Christ. You, you can tell that the spirits that were in her they were enjoying themselves because they had all the control and Jesus has put a stop on their activities praise the Lord clap hands with Jesus Christ hallelujah Yes, Rotanganeza Morena is so Christo. If Lam Zimuka, Buguyava, Corinta, will be in the Mandia Vutano, the Manatukuya Fumisumbe, Eri Ane Avaka Christo, Nichibum Buyachi, Sha, Zirara Zopera. Hallelujah. Ziambao Zauri, Zingapano, South Africa, Owa Mubuso, Wachitarura, Hajenawa Democracy. Wa parte iti, au chado doa wabuya. Zino mubuso wa sisi wa waho kabone, au chado doa wabuya. Wone baka mubuso wa wuchiro, wa manda, wa cheza. You, you are now in the new kingdom of light, power, Zino, light, not mosi, darkness kingdom, light mosi kingdom. Mosi satane, achibu ya kabone. When the devil tries to come back to you. Because when he leaves, he will try to, you know, to come back. When he finds Jesus in your heart, King of kings, Lord of lords, the Lion of Judah, it's a sure case he will never be able to come to the inside. The driver and the tie zone and the one who will get him and the one who will continue now the one who will go to the hospital. Like a dog running after the car. Cannot catch the car when the driver is driving going forward. When we do not have a church, we need a church. 
ene hafunze wa Yesu Kristo we afa avua odzura hotungo ya chanda cha ola cha mudzi only the church which preaches about Jesus Christ who was crucified who rose from the grave who is now seated in heaven at the right hand of the father kereke isatanga nyese zwithu true church which does not mix kereke ine yeso hatusi winga zwithu zwifariwaho church which does not help god Jesus Christ does by himself. Radoba hapo rayolobedziwa madini. Also to be immersed. Nga uri fela mudzimu leri vatenda ho valobedzwa vadochidzwa. The word of God says those who shall be saved and baptized Chimwe shall hafu. be saved. Otoma na Mose from today. Bone vambo dibudza vathu vothe ve baba sa zwe dibu uri ha ben ndo chidzwa. Hufiri kunda satane nga vutanzi ha miromo yashu nanga marofa angwana. We overcome the devil by the word of our testimony and by the blood of Jesus. Now you go and testify to your family members, your friends, even at work, and tell them that I'm saved, I'm born again by the blood of yes, Jesus. Jesus Christ says, whoever testifies about me before men, I will also testify about him before my father in heaven. So the other thing is from today you must learn that when you pray you pray only in the name of Jesus. Have that fellowship with Jesus. Take Jesus as your best best friend who is closer to you more than even you yourself. When you speak to him he will also speak to you in your heart. Ngaori Yesu Kristo ndi mutu ofelera ho because Jesus Christ is a human being just like me and you. And we are chira. And he is alive. Zinanela Yesu Kristo. In the name of Jesus. Are the doari bandere murena chanda. Clap hands again for Jesus, King of Kings. Hallelujah. Hey. Ha chitoba chibidzo. Danu bandera murena zwa ndanga chibidzo kecho. Aba vathu ndi vanji we. Praise the Lord. Potangana na Yesu. Hallelujah. World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ.